and welcome to Rose at Home. I am very much at home in our new house and we are about to start building our second piece of furniture. As I said, we got a table off of Facebook Marketplace and hopefully we'll be showing you that soon. I've got some work I need to do on it. But right now we are about to build a bed from Wayfair. It's not the first one that I had considered. The main thing that I wanted was an upholstered headboard. I haven't had one, I don't think ever, to be honest. And the last bed that I had had like wrought iron and stuff. You couldn't sit up in bed and read. And I liked the idea of being able to sit up, lean back against the headboard while I'm reading, if that's how I feel like reading. So that's what I ordered. Hopefully that is what is in this box. We are about to start pulling out pieces and then we're gonna try to put this puppy together. So stick around and watch what happens. So we've got all the pieces out of the box now. I have now been able to look through the instruction book. I'm one of those weird people. I like when there's written instructions along with the pictures and there are zero written instructions. Everything is just, I need to interpret images and I'm not the best at that. So I am more nervous than I would have been had there been words to describe things. So I'm now going to attempt step one, and hopefully this will go fine. There are 12 steps, and so here we go. Okay, so it looks like the first step is to put on the legs on the, this is the footboard, and then these are, I don't know what they are, boards. <laughs> and so, okay, so the drawing has, And we have finished up one. Yay, just 11 more to go. Okay, so we are ready for step two. We are putting bracket thingies. <laughs> I don't know what they are on the outsides of the headboard. I'm gonna put those on and then we will continue. Cue the music. So we are on step three now. Um, we are putting these long side pieces onto the headboard. I don't understand how something that's gonna hold up to people sleeping on it is all put together with an Allen wrench. Um, but that's the directions, so we're gonna go with it. Okay, so I am now at step four. I've got the headboard and the footboard put together. And so now I have to put what I thought was a side piece is not a side piece. It goes in the bottom of the headboard in with more of those M screws and that Allen wrench that Liam picked up and put somewhere. And so this is going. Um, I think the thing that I'm noticing the most is just how lightweight all of this is and I'm really concerned. Um, it wasn't expensive, but 
it was still money and I'd, I'd hate for it to fall apart. I'm, I'm, I'm hopeful, but I'm now a little concerned because I, I also ordered a couch for us to put together, not from Wayfair, the couch I ordered from Ikea. And so I just, I just don't know how, how solid this stuff is going to be, but we'll see when we get there. Um, I'm just going to march forward because I don't really have another choice right now and put this together. So we are about halfway done. We've got one more step to do on the headboard. So here is my advice if you are putting together this table or this table, if you are putting together this bed or one like it. This center piece right here that went between the headboard, it did not seem to be long enough. So I put these big screws in on this side and Liam's side didn't reach, but it's the right piece. So I had to undo these so that they were there but not screwed in and it gave this some wiggle room, put his in and then go back and forth tightening each side until now they're tightened flush and it perfectly fits just fine. Um, it's I guess because it's supposed to hold it together so that's why it is that way. So we are now putting on these little pieces and here's what I'm so worried that I'm gonna put the wrong thing in the wrong place. These ones is versus these ones. These ones are not the ones I need. I need these ones. So they are gonna go on here with more of those screws. And I think this is how the slides are going to attach. And we're getting there. So let's get to it. super tight the other side I put it there and, and the screws went in straight away so I don't know just that one side was wonky um, we are now doing the same thing on the other side and then we have to put together two of the side slats so I'm over here by the closet and let me get these turned on So we are really in the home stretch. I don't know how long this video is, but it feels like we've been here all day. But we are now putting the sides and the headboard and the footboard all together. So I need Liam's hands. So this is gonna be just kind of a one shot from far away. Let's get this finished, okay.
So we have one more large piece. It goes across here. And then we're just to the slats. So we're really almost done at this point. The next day. Okay. It's a different day and I'm in different clothes. And that is because I needed to get power tools. So the last step that required putting in screws, there's no actual holes drilled into the bed for the screws. And I'm sure people with much more upper body strength than me can muscle these in with a regular Phillips head screwdriver, but that ain't me. So um, I've got three more corners to get with this drill, and then we're on to the slats. We really are in the home stretch. All of the pieces are on. We just need to lay the slats on top. So Liam's gonna have to get out from behind that camera. sideways because this is the same height as me. And let's go down. Okay. Now lift and push. Because the slots are Velcro, so that should hold it in. Okay. So two days and a lot more work than I thought, and I sure hope this was interesting to you. Um, we have finally got the bed together. It seems really solid. Um, again, not sponsored, not gifted, not... I, not sponsored, not gifted, not anything. Um, bought all of this myself. These companies don't know that I exist, but the bed was from Wayfair. Um, I'm going to actually ask Liam to come out from behind the camera. Thank you, thank you. Thank so, you. as far as difficult or ease of putting it together, what would you, what do you think? It's really easy because you did most of the work. <laughs> I just um, hung out. Yeah, it, it was. If you like directions with words, the, I don't know if this is all, I, this is my first piece of Ikea furniture, so I don't know if this is everything Ikea, but there were no words in the directions, it was just pictures. So if, if you are not geom, geometrically, geometry is not your thing, and, and that, that was difficult for me. Um, but once I was sure that I didn't have things backwards and that kind of thing, that was fine. Um, 
the Allen wrench, you gotta make sure you got good hands because that was, I don't get the dancing. Um, he's dancing to being finished with this bed, I guess. But yeah, so would I buy the bed again knowing what I know? Yes. Yeah, I really like it. It's pretty. I have obviously haven't slept in it yet. I haven't even made it. Um, and the mattress, if you are curious, is a Dream Cloud mattress. Um, the middle tier Dream Cloud. They were offering a deal where you got. Um, $500 off the mattress and then two pillows, a set of sheets and a mattress cover, which I'm about to put on. And so it seemed like a good deal. I read a lot of reviews. It seemed, again, not sponsored. I don't have any kind of codes for you. I couldn't tell you how it is because I haven't slept on it yet, but I will. Um, so if you're curious, you know, in, in a month or two, because you're going to subscribe right now, let me know what you think and let me, if you have, if you have, if you have any questions or want to know what I think, I will absolutely give you an update once I start sleeping on it. It looks really plush. It looks really firm. It it looks like I'm going to enjoy it. Here's hoping. But thank you so much for sticking around to watch this go together. Here I'm hoping the editing is good because Liam is supposed to be doing it. So this is going to be interesting. And I hope to see you next week when we're going to be doing more things to get this house ready for us to move in. Bye. Where'd she go? What? They took her.